in this day and age, paper documents, physical meetings, and handshakes are all things of the past. And I dare say, will be missed. But life goes on and electronically signing your documents has become the new normal. E-signatures have been shunned for the longest time because they're very much prone to forgery and misrepresentation. Now, e-signatures have been necessitated which makes for a more flexible work environment. In this video, we're going to be talking about adding signatures to Excel. We mentioned a while ago that e-signatures were very much prone to forgery and misrepresentation. Microsoft allows you to create your own digital ID to counter this. They allow you to create a digital certificate that you can use to create your signatures so other users can verify the legitimacy of your signature. We'll leave a link of the different sites that you guys can use to create your digital signature down below. The old way of doing electronic signatures is having an image file of your signature that either has a transparent background or a white background and just dragging on that to your Word or Excel document. This method doesn't have any way to validate the source of the signature unlike the legit way of doing it. Now I'm going to show you how to insert a signature the most secure way that Microsoft wants you to do. This is really easy. First, in our spreadsheet, we open up the Insert tab and in the text group, we look for this icon right here. Once you click on it, the Signature Setup dialog box appears. Input the suggested signer, make sure you write the full name, input the title and email address, and any instructions for the signer. You have two options you can check. You can allow the signer to add comments in the sign dialog, and you can show the sign date in the signature line. Once you press OK, you'll create the signature line. The X portion is where the signature goes, and below are the deets. You can move it around and resize it depending on where you want to put it. So this is great to place in a form like an invoice sheet. Speaking of invoice sheets, be sure to check out our invoice sheet template at simplesheets.co. To sign it, simply right-click and press Sign. It asks you for your digital ID, which you can get from the Microsoft partners that we linked down below. I won't enter a signature in this example for privacy reasons, but you get the idea more or less. If you're on a tablet and already have your digital ID enabled in your device, you can directly sign on the signature line. And that's the easy way and the proper way of adding signatures to Excel. No pen and paper required. If you guys found this video useful, feel free to give us a like and make sure you subscribe to Simple Sheets for more Excel content. I'll see you guys on the next one.